It's show number 32, and I'm sad because this will be the last episode of Part of Our World because it is our closing weekend. Show 32. Here we have the water, drinking the water. No! You want to know where your goddamn receipts? <laughs> Cannibalism at its finest. <laughs> I don't like to be filmed. Bottle. I didn't sign a photo release. Nobody else did either. Okay, well, you'll be hearing from my manager. Who's your manager? JS Model and Talent. You know, the drag queen that lives downtown. Yes, and the interview chair this week is our very own little chef, Autumn! Say hello, little chef. Hi. So, Autumn, how have you liked the show all summer? I loved it. This was my first show ever. This was your first show ever? Oh my gosh, she's so talented. What has been the hardest part of the show for you? Probably chef. That's when um you get tossed up and down in the little blanket, right? Yeah. That's difficult. What has been your favorite part of this whole summer? Um, meeting new friends. Cool. Autumn and I are friends now. <laughs> so, this has been show 32. It's pretty hot out today. Um, but stay tuned for show 33, and then 34 and 35 are on the same day, but show 35 I'm doing something very exciting where I am giving out the Grimsby's. Um, and tomorrow I will probably talk about the nominations or I'll do that at the matinee, but very exciting. Bye. Bye. And welcome to show 33. This is what we look like before the show. And this is after! Say hello to Prince Eric and Ursula. Hi! Hi. <laughs> Showtime! Woohoo! Guys, this is show 33. Whoa. 33. I feel like I it was just like show 20. <laughs> I know. <laughs> just, Here we go. It's almost the same. Are we ready? We're ready! This place is called. Let's do a show. <laughs> So, we're backstage, I'm here with Prince Eric, it's Ryan. We don't know each other yet. And we, we have not yet met on stage, and this is actually the only break in the entire show that we have together. Together, and we've never spent it together. No. Until now. Well, I don't really like you in real life. Oh, okay. <laughs> don't feed the birds. This is what happens. So, this is one of my only breaks in the show I have three um, and it's right before part of your world and so I literally redo my makeup or fix it and rewarm up because if that number isn't good then no one's gonna like the show it'll ruin the whole show for everyone so I'm gonna go do that <laughs> Hi, I'm back. We're here at intermission. This is Josh. He plays Scuttle. You've probably met him already because hey, this girl. is like episode 5003. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's what it feels like. <laughs> it's week 13, I think. Is that really? Of Not of shows, but of our contract. Oh, wow. I think wow. 13, 13 weeks. Yeah. Anyway, um, and we decided that this was the perfect opportunity to do a hashtag shameless plug. There you go. Yep. Um, so, um, Josh, what are you doing next? I want to do the Rocky Horror Picture Show in October Ooh. playing Dr. Scott and Eddie. Ooh, is it 21 yeah. plus or 21 all plus. 21 plus yeah no children at this one it's sorry a bar, though. It's a come drink. This, is a bar. And <laughs> this, is, this is our uh our stone mermaid, <laughs> our mermaid. <laughs> and what are you doing next tori what's up next for you i will be doing a new musical as a part of the new york new works festival Ooh. um which is at the end of this month oh, I, wow. i've already started Very fast. i've already started rehearsals girl you busy and uh tomorrow <laughs> i mean not tomorrow but monday I continue rehearsals in New York, and that's New York. Uh, my show is on the 31st, and the festival runs through October 5th. That's awesome. So, yeah. Yeah. We, we have no shame. All right, well, we're going to go back and get ready for a second act. Second act! Bye. Woo! Bye! <laughs>
So here I am meeting the princess, and I think she's ready to say, have a good night and see you at the next show, right, Ariel? Yes, goodbye, have a wonderful evening. Bye. Show 34, um, I had to make myself look a little more realistic today because I'm about to go meet the audience and pretend to be Grimsby, so when they get up close to my face, they have to see that I'm actually old, even though I'm not. Right, Josh? Yep. So today's a matinee. I did a meet and greet before this and talked like this Ooh. for a whole hour. Good. Um. Oh, I like that. Yeah. For more bucks, you said, right? So we talked like this for a whole hour. I'm tired. It's a matinee. It's hot. And we're giving away the Grimsby's tonight. So stay tuned for the next 30 seconds when I'm going to transition from show 34 to show 35. So here I am on the ground with um, Chris Jakes, Hello. who is the loving mother of our little chef. Um, and she gets the first Grimsby of the night. Woo! Ooh! Um, and the award she wins is our Frequent Flyer Award for coming to every single show. Every single one? Every single one. You never got tired of it? Never. Oh, such a dedicated follower. Um, so the rest of the Grimsby's shall be given out soon, um, and have a good show, 30... Five. Five. Thirty-five. Bye-bye! Hello, and welcome to show 35, the Grimsby's. The following are our categories. Most vlog appearances. Least vlog appearances. Uh, funniest clip. Best photo bomb. Best funny face. Favorite takeover. Best interview. Best dance moves. May the best woman or man or group win. So here I am with Lane Snova, who is the lucky recipient of our first Grimsby. In the limelight for most vlog appearances. How do you feel, Miss Snova? I feel fan fantastic. I don't win anything ever, so this is like very cool. Yes, excellent. She was in the most vlog clips. I'd like to thank my mom and my dad and my sisters for being my family, and my, thanks parents for birthing me. That was pretty lit. Excellent. You have a good night, Miss Snowball. Thanks. So here I am with Sarah Martin, who is the recipient of the second Grimsby Award for better backstage, or least vlog appearances while still appearing <laughs> on the vlog. What have you to say to your fans? Sarah? I just just want to thank everyone for you know being with me through this process in my Excellent. one my one vlog moment. Yes. I appreciate it. Lovely. Yes. yes. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you so much. I I'm automatically chef petite. First award is funny clips. Becky Gill's bitter moment. The weather. Ryan Arena Mama. We got a Quaida. We got a Lista. We got Ariel. We got a Duna. We got Adele. We got a Luna. And we got a Rima Mama. Brendan. Sad Puppet. Josh. No. French fries. Yeah. We didn't have any French fries tonight, boys. What? No French fries. No French fries? No. Damn. All right. Next time. I'll see you later. <laughs> Lane Whack. Anna McGrath, who is the chef and also oh, seagull, the seagull. purple seek. Oh, there she is. So here I am with Ryan, who plays <laughs> Prince Eric, and he has won a Broadway contract. Not quite. You have won the third Grimsby Award, Character Actor, for the funniest clip with Arima Mama. Thank you. You're welcome. I'd like to thank the Academy and... What? What Academy? 
you know, because I'm accepting my Oscar. I would have compared this to the Tonys, but all right. Oh, okay. Y yes. I mean, all right. Theater. Yeah. Theater. Yes. Good job. Yes. Well done. Yes. Hello. My name is John Moynihan, producing director of Prescott Park Arts Festival. Up next is Breaking Character. Our, nomin our nominees are Izzy for Izzy Bombs, Laura for OG Photobomb, Lane for Asparagus, and Elliot for Ice Cold. So here I am with Izzy Began, who is a lucky winner of the fourth Grimsby Award for breaking character, which is the best photo bomb of the season. For all of her Izzy bombs. Thank you, thank you. I'd just like to thank all the strangers out there in the world that have let me photo bomb. Accurate things that I happening inspire. in the background right now. I'd just like to say my last comment. Where did she go? Hi, I'm Lane Snover, and up next we have Facial Feature, and the nominees are Ryan for A Little Nervous, Trevor for Photobombing, and Lauren for making every single face during Mer Sisters. So I'm here with Lauren Marin, who plays Andrina, and she has won our fifth Grimsby Award for Facial Featured. For the funniest faces throughout the entirety of Mer Sister Sister. Yay! How do you feel, Miss Mary? I feel on top of the world. Excellent. Yes, do you have a funny face for us? Yes. This is um, a crowd pleaser, often. Um. <laughs> Excellent. Well deserved. Hi, I'm Emily, and I am costumes per option, scenic painting, and everything under the sun. And up next is Marvelous Mutiny. Um, and the nominees are Izzy and Katie, the ASMs, Team Evil made of Lane, Adam, and Marjorie, and the Mer Sister Sister. So here I am with all of the Mer Sisters to give a wonderful announcement that you have all won Marvelous Mutiny for the best takeover by a landslide <laughs> unanimously! Wow! Yes! 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 Yes, and here to accept the award for Grace is Kylie. Uh, what do you have to say, Mer Sisters? We did it! We did it! Wow! I would like to thank all of us Got for him. being so funny. Excellent. Except for the gold sister. I provided. Who's the real girl? Gold. Who's the real gold sister? <laughs> no. Hello, I'm going to inter introduce myself as Ben Anderson. I'm the president because I have yet to be on this vlog, and I have the honor of greeting one of the Grimsby, Grimsby uh, nom nominees. Up next is the Diana Ross Award, and the nominees are Tori, Lane, Ryan, and Trevor. So here I am with Tori Britt, who plays Ariel, and she is the lucky recipient of Grimsby number seven for the Diana Ross Award, or Best Interview. Do you have anything to say to your fans? No? Right, we're in Act Two, Ariel can talk. Well, congratulations, my dear. Hi, I'm Abby Snee, I'm the Water Captain, and I'm here to announce our next Grimsby Award. Our next award is called the Dancing Queen Award. Our nominees are Lane Snover with Water Bottle Dance, Gavin Sorge, I Got Shackles, Trevor Gatcom and Izzy Began Dancing Backstage, Izzy Began and Katie O'Leary Backstage Waltz. So I'm present here with Gavin Salt, who plays... Flounder! Flounder, yes, who has won our 8th Grimsby Award for the Dancing Queen, with the best dance moves for Shackle Dance. Oh my gosh, I've worked so hard for this, I would just like to thank the Academy, yes. and, and God, of course, and... Uh, Excellent. Sorry, I'm just gonna... 
I had a speech prepared, but I don't think I'm gonna make it. Oh my. Just thank you so much. Yes, excellent. Good job. Thank you. Yes, dancing queen. Well, a bittersweet day has come upon us. Closing night. Show 36. One of my favorite memories uh, of this show is it was the first rehearsal I went to because I was out the first week and it was a sing through of the whole entire show and I didn't know anybody and everyone was so kind and welcoming and just hearing everyone's voices all together through the whole show for the first time was truly a magical experience and I just knew this summer was going to be fantastic from that moment on so it holds a good place in my heart. My favorite memory or one of my favorite memories is when um, at our final music rehearsal when we all got to sit around and have a, like a concert version of our show we all got to sing for each other and it was great and yeah uh, my favorite memory is during uh, tech week we finally got the tub that was supposed to be Ariel's bathtub and it was like this big like uh, like a redneck beer tub that you use for like cookouts. That was my favorite moment. My favorite memory was when I got to be a seagull. Oh, then get in there, my get favorite back in the memory back. was pulling John Moynihan's pants up and pinning them on stage. Good job, Moynihan. <laughs> Uh, my favorite memory was going on very quickly last night for Connor and during the Lake Poisson having both Terrell and Caitlin behind me putting my pants on so they didn't fall off immediately as soon as I walked around the table. I, I'm going to say my best memory actually um, wasn't even me in the show was when I rolled my ankle the first time and I got to see the show out front, right? And it was actually when I got to see John Moynihan come on as Chef Louie and he absolutely killed it. So my favorite memory was seeing the show. Seeing the, a show that I was in, which that's never happened before in all of my career of being an actor. So that was pretty cool, yeah. My favorite memory was opening weekend after She's in Love, I was running off and I started falling halfway and then I just kept falling the entire run across the stage and by the time I got off of the stage I just fell and slammed into the ground but it was really funny and it just made me very happy so Hi, I'm Abby the Water Captain and I'm Victoria Water Person and uh, my favorite memory was probably staying on stage for all of She's in Love and holding the rock so Gavin didn't die. My favorite memory was probably falling on my face on stage in front of everyone because it was hilarious. <laughs> my favorite memory is when I was standing next to the tech trailer and I looked across and I saw Izzy and Katie trying to take a picture but because of their headsets they knocked together and they weren't able to take the picture and it was they like here's, here's them take the picture boom and it was really funny but like I just love that and I think of that every time I think of the show. My favorite summer moment was today when Bobby had to introduce two new hosts instead of Connor and he screams in his big booming authoritative voice and here's the man who brings this brouhaha to the Piscataqua and here we're looking in closely because it's not a man it's a man and a woman and then he says here's Connor and I'm trying so hard not to laugh right now just thinking of that. Hi Bobby. One of my favorite memories is in places watching all the people that are waiting to go just dancing and hanging out with each other. That's my favorite part. Well my favorite part of this summer as Grimsby's understudy and ensemble member has definitely been all the friends that I've made as cliche as that sounds and definitely never having to go on for Grimsby. My favorite memory is about to happen because I get to go on stage as a fish and be part of the My favorite memory is the whole show. I will definitely remember the whole thing. My favorite memory of the show is getting to do this all summer. Thank you for being part of our world.